Assalamu alaikum, it's your brother Safraz here from One Nation. The UK team has just arrived here in Syria, subhanAllah. We are in the area of Sarmada in Idlib. If you look around, the devastation is absolutely horrific. We all, alhamdulillah, the whole world has focused their love and support in Turkey with all the devastation of the earthquake that happened literally six days ago. And subhanAllah, everybody's hearts are with Syria. But alhamdulillah, we have been here from day one from over a decade supporting them and your support needs to continue we have just arrived a little while ago here in rural idlib in syria in the blessed lands of sham and alhamdulillah through your generous donations and support we are able to provide your donations firsthand to the people that are in need. As you will see here today, that there are a lot of camps that are here, which were set up just a few days ago as a response. So, five days. Allahu Akbar. Five days, his brother with his uh, children here. He's got a little girl that's sitting outside on his motorbike, uh, his wife. And subhanAllah, uh, I touched this little, cute little child's hands, and his hands are absolutely freezing. But your help and your support makes that difference and we can provide some warmth, some love and care for our brothers and sisters, inshallah. Alhamdulillah, we in, uh, One Nation is in Syria at the moment, in Idlib. MashaAllah, we just arrived and uh, we're just uh, giving food distribution out. And we've just given our first box out for a family that's been affected in this earthquake. Um, it's first time I'm doing something like this, you know, it, all this time you sort of think that, you know what, we, We've come to the stage where we're actually giving to someone that's been actually affected, you know, by this earthquake and it's, it's you know, it's emotional. They are losing hope very, very fast of finding anyone alive here because it is now day nine since this horrific catastrophe that has taken place here. They, however, said that last night they found one sister that when they found her, she was in the position of sajda. And out of respect for the sister, they have female volunteers who came in and covered her up and respectfully took her out. But how fortunate was, he, was she uh, that she will be raised on the day of Qiyamah in the position of sajda as that is the last thing she did. Make dua for the people of Islam especially Jindiras, where there's very, very little aid coming in. Jazakumullahu khair wa assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.